typical German football sound as the hunting horns are blown and here are the two teams and here's Rangers first Martin the goalkeeper and as the teams come on now here's number two Johansson Danish international McKinnon number five Greg number six the skipper and Robert number three the back four the middle two the Davy Smith and Johnny the 18 year old up front will be Henderson, number seven, Alex Smith, number eight, number nine, Roger Hind, and number 11, Billy Johnston. And Fire are in the tracksuit top, Rangers in the dark shirt. Stadium of Forest of Manor. And the Bayern team, Meyer, also goalkeeper for the West German international side. Number two, Novak. Number five, the great Beckenbach. Number six, Oak, the captain. Number three, Kupfer Schmidt. And the middle line, number ten, Kuhlmann. Number four, Roth. And up front, number seven, Dabsliga, an international. Number eight, Paul Halser. Number nine, the great man of Germany, Müller. And number 11, Reninger. And the far side breaks out into a sea of red and white as Bayern go across to take the applause. But everyone from Munich's here to cheer on their favorites. There's the inside trio. Ball at his feet, Müller. And off we go for the European Cup Winners' Cup Final. This is Johnston. Number nine, Müller. Ball house. Wait for Rangers now comes Greg. Johnston. And offside, the linesman, right in line. Three kick to Munich. Our turning isn't going to be so easy tonight. Moving forward for the return. Oh, a beautiful ball to Brunner. And obviously that's how Munich are going to use Beckham Bar. He's going to be quick on the break, coming forward and take part in those passing bars. And there's Bobby Seat, the Rangers coach. A lot of room now, which Alex Smith. Midfield, all his. Jardine to Henderson. Up comes Johansson. Johnson. Beckham Bar. Oh, great chance for Smith. That was one that popped up there out of the blue for Alex Smith. 55, a 50,000 pound buy from Dunfermline. 
really a half back beginning to roll maybe we are going to see some of these flashes of individual greatness we did which we know Henderson has at the moment though Muller getting a lucky rebound how quickly can Rangers break this is Johnston surprised if Rangers got a goal against the goalkeeper like Meyer from that distance, even on this skiddy turf. Kupfer Smith is playing very well on Beckenbauer, still positioned behind his four backs. Only once have we seen him break. Fullman. Lott. Noticeable that with every one of the Munich players willing and ready to take a man on. <laughs> Greg for Rangers. Now comes his midfield part partner. Smith and cross now to Jardy. And Jardy pushed by Brenninger. Free kick to Rangers. Greg. Number five, Beckenbauer. Number six, Oak. Stars of the World Cup. It's a corner to Rangers. That was one time the high ball really went Heinz way. That was the way to come into the tackle. Didn't quite pay off still. Greg, Greg to Henderson. Rangers beginning to look a little more likely in this match now. Johnston. Hind up Bill Henderson beginning to cut inside. Well, Hind made a brave enough effort for that one. Certainly, Hind has got all this shankly grit and determination. Being closely marked all the time by Oak, number six. Corner to Rangers. Look. So far we've seen very little of Muller. There he is, number nine. Oh, a brilliant save. A 
but certainly Hyde is creating a tremendous amount of trouble for the Munich defenders. Free kick to Munich. Kuhlmann to Kupferschmidt. Alex Smith to Hein. Now, quick turn is murderous maneuver in these conditions. Allhauser to Muller. Allhauser. And away goes Muller. Two Rangers men with him. And the flag is up for offside, and the referee's taken no notice of it. Referee is now nodded towards his linesman and given a goal kick. While the players refresh themselves, let's let's catch up with the latest news headlines. And so over to Michael Aspel in at Alexandra Palace, London, and the BBC Newsroom. Lobello now leading his two officials and the two teams were all set for the second half. And certainly the Rangers are because this is Rangers led by the skipper Greg, there's Martin. And the Rangers fans have the chance to cheer all on their own. There's Scott Simon, their manager on the left with the trophy hat, Davy Wilson walking with him. Led by their skipper, Alt, the Bayern Munich side. All for ease of reference, we're calling Munich tonight. Their welcome is stupendous, as one might imagine. And this is almost a home match for them. But don't let's grumble about that. Remember, West Ham United beat Munich 1860 at Wembley. As Müller, remember, he's got broken wrist strapped up they had to move the leather casing an inch this morning before the referee would pass it a safe for him to play he gets to see it protruding on his right arm you see nothing of Muller though in this match but Kennels had him in his pocket the referee checks his watches the banners wave and Rangers start the second half of the European Cup Winners' Cup Final. The score sheet blank. Five minutes of the second half gone. Still no score. And again, Rangers slow starters as they were in the first half. Pullman. Well, so far McKinnon's beaten Muller in the air and on the ground. And again. player this Beckerbauer is. Muller. Well, he didn't have the grace or the skill of Beckenbar. Greg. A bad ball to Johnston. Gave him no chance. There's Muller. Not been the glittering sensation we all feared he might be. And the 
Foul on Proven free kick for Rangers. Paul yeah. Hassan. Well, certainly the Rangers defence has done its job well. Now neutralise this Munich attack. Now up to the front man. Here's Davy Smith. To Alex Smith. Robin Henderson now, Hind the flags up the offside the line the referee hasn't seen it number eight Alex Smith and it's a free kick for offside Munich Not far away from victory, a bit more speed in the build-up. A bit more fire near goal. There's only Hein who's really a danger to the Munich defences yet. Wheeler to Allhauser. Wheeler. Reading there. Reading there, this could be it. It is not. Everybody thought it had hit the back of the net, but the side netting a corner. Well, that shows you how Victor can be snatched away from you. Whatever did the lady in the black hat say? Renninger with the corner for Munich. Dave Smith. Number four wrote. Ten seconds. Coleman. Five seconds to go. And it's all over. After 90 minutes, it's Bayern Munich nil, Rangers nil, and so there's 50 minutes extra time each way. Johansson penalised free kick to Munich running at the man he brought down number 11 running at to Rote Olhausa sure Munich are just waiting for the moment when they can throw back on bar through Rote he scores It was Olhauser, and Olhauser was the man who put it through, and wrote a score to this, Tchaikovsky the coach. And there's an invasion of the pitch. And let's see how Olhauser made that goal. There he is, and wrote his run off the ball beautifully. And back now on the pitch, we have thousands of police getting off the hundreds of supporters who ran on Munich 1-0 in the lead cleverly taken goal beautifully worked goal Now then, Rangers are going to have to pull themselves up by their bootlaces. It's a corner. Corner to Rangers.
two minutes left. Kinnan. Johnny. And Rangers now with almost desperation, bumping high ones into the penalty area, hoping for a mistake. But now here's a chance to break. Root, the man who got the goal, and across to Novak. Corner to Munich. One minute and five seconds left. Munich lead. One goal to nil. Second successive German victory. If Munich can win this game. Novak. They've just got to keep possession now for 45 seconds. Kuhlmann. Nafsinger. Kupferschmidt. 25 seconds. Johnston for Rangers. There's more supporters, mass almost by the touchline. 10 seconds. Unless time is added on, there is no chance for Rangers now, I should think. Johnston. And Mr. Lobella with the watch in his hand. It's Greg. Henderson. And a corner, and time is not added on for corner. Must be all over now, the European Cup Winners' Cup. Must be with Bayern Munich. And it is all over. Bayern Munich have beaten Rangers. One goal to nil. And the crowd stream out of the pitch. The goal scorer wrote after 94 minutes. And a dangerous situation develops as at Nuremberg as thousands pour onto the pitch. The dejected Rangers walk off the park, beaten because they didn't have a forward line, and there is Tchaikovsky, the coach of the winning team, congratulating his captain, Oak. And so, with the final score, Bayern Munich have won the European Cup Winners' Cup, beating Rangers one goal to nil, a goal scored by Roth four minutes after the start of extra time. We say hard luck, Rangers, Good night from Nuremberg and back to London.